Hong Kong has faced unprecedented challenges in the past three years due to the protests in 2019 and the ongoing pandemic. Um, the 14th five-year plan has outlined the competitiveness of Hong Kong as an international financial hub. What will you do to ensure the stability and uh, um, to uh, strengthen the overall competitiveness of, of Hong Kong? Well, in one of my um, three areas which I uh, emphasize when I uh, declare that I ran for election, uh, one is to consolidate a firm foundation uh, for Hong Kong's development so that the, all the risk factors are well controlled and there will be good contingency plans for uh, different areas of risk. Of course, one important area is ensuring that Hong Kong will remain a stable and safe place for people to go about their day-to-day -day business. Because without stability, there will be no prosperity. And the second thing is, after you have created a very uh, stable and firm um, uh, defense mechanism, then you can proceed without worry uh, to full uh, development. Look ahead, don't have to look back. And that is why in my manifesto, I have said that in at least uh, six areas that uh, I want to um, make Hong Kong even stronger. Uh, in simple terms, it means that those areas that we have been strong uh, consistently, we strengthen and consolidate, we make them even bigger and, and more attractive. But for the new areas where we have potential, then we develop those potential uh, and also create um, not just um, our own strength, but create the room for expansion. And obviously, uh, one important room for expansion is the GBA, uh, is the full integration with, uh, uh, with the country. Adding a further thing, which is Hong Kong's unique strength, that is, we connect to the world, we are gateway to mainland. So all three factors add together, create a great potential for Hong Kong, and it will really consolidate our advantages. And where people can realize their dream of development, their dream of success, talents will come, money will come, and also the critical mass will come. And uh, I'm very hopeful in this area. You just mentioned GBA, a Greater Bay Area. How do you propose to uh, make use of Hong Kong's strategic advantages to better uh, develop Greater Bay Area? And how will you encourage young people to explore opportunities in the area? I think, first of all, we have to be very clear of uh, telling people uh, what are the directions uh, they should go in grasping the opportunity of GBA. So the clear messaging is important. Uh, where what people can do what, and how they can get help, and what are the uh, different schemes to facilitate uh, their development and their potential success. And that is very important. And already, I think, um, the GBA cities have been doing that. A lot of um, special schemes have been created to facilitate people to uh, start their own business. So it will be something that I will be pushing very strongly. And I see uh, a lot of um, uh, echoes already. I've heard a lot of echoes because I have uh, good friends in the various GBA cities who have been sending, first of all, supportive information, supportive messages to me, knowing that I, 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 I was successfully elected. And they also uh, send me similar messages of doing these things jointly uh, with uh, even bigger commitment uh, try new things together. So I'm very hopeful in uh, uh, pushing forward all, all these uh, ideas.